And let's end the section off with that person I really need to rant about. Oh my god. Okay. Now, the person I mentioned earlier that, like... So, you know how I mentioned earlier that R. Kelly had, like, a piss kink and crap? So, this person does, too. Now, <laughs> it's not funny. I think piss kinks are weird. I'm not trying to kink shame, but, like, it sounds unhygienic, in my opinion. It just sounds unhy- un- unhygienic. And everyone that I... I've ever heard of with a piss kink, which are like three people. They're all terrible. R. Kelly is like the worst of them all. And this person I'm talking about right now is probably the second. That's wild to me. <laughs> so this person is known as PP Girl. Now, me just saying that name, M.O. Tumblr is probably losing their crap. <laughs> ML Tumblr knows who this person is because they commented on my post. I'm on ML Tumblr. Remember this? Remember I'm on there since like last year? Yeah. So they commented on my post for the first time in May when I'm in my Soul Crusher um, post on there. I remember seeing this on my computer. I didn't have my phone at the time. Um, I was supposed to be doing schoolwork, but I went on Tumblr to talk about Soul Crusher because I just watched it in front of my own mother in Portuguese. <laughs> She didn't understand a, a thing that happened in that episode. Like, she saw, like, I think the end of it. I forgot what happened that day. I remember seeing the comment from them, and I was like, oh, what? Adrian and Zoe? What? <laughs> What's going on here? I just I just mentioned Zonette as, like, a friendship, not a relationship. <laughs> I just put their names together. Just cause, just, if I put me and Vincent's names together... Which I've done that before, actually, as like a si- like a sisterly thing, like a sibling thing before like they changed their pronouns and stuff. Like before that, like back during early 2020, like we were called, I called them, I called me and um, Vincent Ashtray. I'm Lee. They were Astra at the time. That was their gotcha name. <laughs> I just revealed that. Like, I missed that name. That name is really cool, actually, though. Like, that's the name of a K-pop group. The foreshadowing is real. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. That's off topic. But like, yeah, like putting people's names together, like they're like friends. Like it's not a shippy thing. Like they thought it was a shippy thing. I just said zone supremacy. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> like I thought it was a cute friendship. Holy crap. <laughs> and like they commented on that. Like they commented on a lot of my posts. I think I still have screenshots of it because I was going to make a whole video about them. But I didn't know that, about this piss king thing. So Yeah. <laughs> You're probably like, Leo, are you, are you, what is in my whole, I just sound like I said my name for a second. I meant to say Lee, not Leah. Um, <laughs> you're probably like, um, Lee, um, why you mentioned your piss kink and stuff? Like, are you actually kink shaming? No, I'm not. It, it's relevant. Like I, I mentioned earlier in the pedophilic category, you, you, ooh, <laughs> it's going to play a part. So they're a Maraca stand. Not to mention them by, like, their actual, like, known user. They have many alt accounts, but, like, they got their actual, like, main account banned. And thank God they did. Because of what they did. Like, the piss kink is relevant, okay? So their t- Tumblr user originally, like, their main account name is Plagan Adrian Bonding is the best. Now... M.O. Tumblr. I know y'all are yelling right now. I can hear your screams. I can feel your pain. <laughs> I hate them. Like, I really hate PP Girl, okay? I'm calling them PP Girl. I don't want to... I On my um thing where I planned this out, like, for a video about them, um, I shortened it to PPG, and I realized that's the initials for Powerpuff Girls, and I'm now just feeling really guilty for doing that. So I'm just not going to come on PPG at all, because, like... Powerpuff Girls, is, it slaps, okay? Stan Buttercup, okay? Stan Buttercup and Bliss, okay? I love Bliss, okay? She was voiced by Wen G in like, uh, uh, the Australian version, I think. We love Raya. <laughs> Raya is Wen G. I'm sorry that's all topic, but like still. PPG, Powerpuff Girls, not PP Girl. <laughs> now, what, now, what PP Girl did was illegal. Now, let me mention something now. PP girl is 22. They say that themselves. They might not be 22, but like still, what they did was wrong. Either way, they're adult or not. 
or even older than that. Like, maybe they made herself younger. I don't know what they did. Now, let me, now I think it's time to mention Harry on Hook now. I mentioned Harry on the Hook earlier. Um, she's a YouTuber that I follow. She's about to hit 100K, subscribe to her. She's made a lot of videos about Miraculous. This is how I found out about, like, the racism thing. Well, I found about agents, right? Male privilege and all you being a token black girl and about PP girl harassing them. Now, I already knew that a Miraculous fan was harassing them, but I didn't know who. I didn't watch the video yet. And I saw they had a follow-up video posted, like, recently. And I was like, oh, God. Okay, let me watch the video real quickly. And when they mentioned Adrian Stan, I immediately knew who it was. Because I was like, no, it better not be them. I went to her Tumblr so fast. <laughs> you, I went to Safari. I looked up Harry on the Hook harassment. Like, I legit looked that up on Tumblr. Like, I'm not kidding. I found the thread. I looked at the tags. It said Plague and Agent Bonding is the best in the tags. And I literally was so mad. <laughs> I had to put my head down. I was like, oh my God, I can't believe you got harassed by them. I almost cry. I'm ready to cry right now because it's actually really sad. I can't. And they're still harassing them. Like, they made a follow-up video. It's actually really sad. And um, this is where I found about the piss kink. And I looked, I looked them up. I, put, I looked up their, um, the user on Tumblr, obviously. Like, PP Girls um, user. Like, you know, I'm not going to say it again. It's a really long user. Holy crap. And I found out about the piss kink before she mentioned it. Before her and I mentioned it. I was watching the video and on Tumblr at the exact same time, okay? And I was floored about what I just heard. Now, I mentioned trigger warning earlier for, like, fetishes, I'm pretty sure. So, this 22-year-old woman made urine fetish pornography of Adrian Agrest. Let that sink in. That's morally disgusting, okay? It's disgusting, and it's illegal, because they're a 22-year-old woman Adrian and Cat Noir, Mr. Buck, freaking Shot Blanc, are literally 14. And Origins, they were 13. Like, it makes it worse, okay? I've never seen this work of art. It's not a work of art. I haven't seen this um stuff ever, and I don't want to see it. You know why? You know why I don't want to see that? It's going to be traumatizing me for the rest of my freaking life. I'm already traumatized from stuff like pornography. Like, I've seen it before. I've already seen enough. I've seen too much, okay? I've seen too much on this internet. Before I even got Tumblr or Twitter. Before I even got that. Like, actual years before that, I actually saw some stuff on the internet. I saw some Sunset Shimmer, th Rule 34 on Google. Oh, <laughs> The only time I ever told my mom about seeing pornography on the internet was with My Little Pony. When I was like eight. That was five years ago. Here we are today. I've seen some weird art of Mary Shep before, which I want to mention in a second. It's on Wattpad, okay? Of course it's on Wattpad. It makes sense. It's Mary Shep. That's the Mary Shep haven, to be honest. <laughs> I've read some good fanfiction on Wattpad, okay? But I've seen some recommendations. And them covers are questionable. I'm going to be honest here with you. Now, PP girl, we need to stop talking about her. She's actually a pedophile, too. Um, she's groomed the Miraculars. She's grooming a few of them. Remember when I said the target audience was like 5 to 11? And I was like a teen audience? Yeah. And um, we're still vulnerable, by the way. We're all children. Like, we're, most of us are children. There's some adults in this fandom, and, like, they're, like, good adults. Like, some of them are good, like, Soft, um, Taylor, Nicole. That's her name, and that's her name, right? I think that's her name. Um, they're good adults in the fandom, okay? They're good adults. I think there's more. I can't remember that off the top of my head. But, like, there's a lot of good people in this fandom. Like, there's actual, like, good adults in the fandom. Yeah. Um, just that one of the good ones, obviously. They're on Tumblr. They're also on Twitter and YouTube. That's why I said, like, I'm not going to mention their name. I said I wasn't going to mention their name, but I did. I had to mention it. 
They're probably going to harass me when I make my whole video about it. I'm just like, I can't today. I'm just going to ignore you. I don't care. Don't even send me pornography of Adrian. I'm not going to do this today. I can't do it. I don't care if you send me. I'm going to report you to police. <laughs> I'm going to report you. I think Ariana did report her to the police, though. I think she did. In the follow-up video, I think she mentioned that. And I, I'm, I'm just like, girl, they did, you need to go to jail. You need to go to jail. Like, you've already messed up enough. And also, I forgot to mention, PP girl actually um, made, um, she wished for Mara to get um, freaking raped. A actual child. Myrna is actually canonically a year older than me. 14, by the way. Just turned 14 in Bafana. And it hasn't been like a whole year miraculous. It doesn't matter. Myrna's still a child. And like this literal adult that's like eight years older than her, basically. Just said for her to like get R-worded. And she hates Marinette, by the way. She actually is like an Adrian Plague, Dusu stan. And also Zoe as well. They had like a Dusu fan, ac- fan account. I think it got banned. No, it didn't. I actually saw it on Tumblr like, like a week ago. I-, I can't. I really, I can't. I might just upload this segment onto YouTube. I might just upload this segment onto YouTube and just be like, hey, be aware of this. Like, I think this person's actually mentally unhinged. I, I think they are. Like, I, what corrupts you so much to the point where you become like a hardcore fan of a TV show made for teens and children? Over, look, they're the same thing. Teens and children are the same thing. Um, made for um children here and make actual pornography. Out of one of the characters, like one of the most popular characters too. Adrian's really popular, more popular than Merida, I'm pretty sure. Like, what corrupts you to do that? Like, oh my, I couldn't imagine doing that. And I'm a child, like, I can draw, but like, I wouldn't corrupt myself to even make that gotcha club. Or gotcha life, even though I can't, but like, Pixar exists. Like, I'd be just painting, like, you can edit stuff, like, in there. I could never even make that stuff on my own. <laughs> like, I could never do that. Like, oh my, the gotcha heaters must like, the, the gotcha heaters are gonna love her. I'm gonna say it right now. The gotcha heaters, PP girl, will legit love each other. And that's actually sad because, like, the people that make gotcha heat are actually children, too. I'm saying it right now. Some of y'all be influencing these children. Like, some of you adults be influencing these children to do some real messed up stuff. Okay? Gotcha influenced me to do some bad stuff, too, in my stories. Watch. I'm going to explain volume two of Gotcha. That's like... Holy crap. I'm still not over this PP girl thing. When I found out that she, had a, that she made the pornography of Adrian, I was shocked. I was still trying to process it for like a whole hour. I was still like shocked. Like, I could, I'm still not over it. Like, it's still messed up. I'm yelling now. I'm lucky I'm home alone. I, I, I really, I. Tomorrow's New Year's Eve. Tomorrow's New Year's Eve. I'm going to spend it, like, just being angry, to be honest. I'm still angry about this after just a week of finding it out, like, a week later. And they're still on the internet. They're still on Twitter. They say, like, bad stuff on Twitter, too. I don't know where her Twitter account is. I'm going to try to find it. I need to find her account. I'm going to, like, report to the police. If they come and harass me, I'm actually going to report it to the police. I'm not kidding. I'm actually going to call the popo on them. Like, I'm calling the FBI, probably, too, like... You're making actual pornography of fictional characters. Like, you're, you're grooming children. Like, you're doing a lot. You're doing too much as a 22-year-old woman. I don't know if you're actually 22 or a woman either. Like, maybe they're lying about their age and their gender. Who knows what they're doing? Like, maybe they're... They don't feel like a troll to me. They feel like, like a, a person that's actually serious about what they're doing. I've been ranting for almost 50 minutes. I'm mad. I'm actually mad. I can't, I, oh my god. I'm just gonna upload this part to YouTube. I'm just gonna upload this part. I'm not gonna upload anything else about, like, Mariah's being problematic. I'm gonna say that for the whole fandom video that I'm gonna make. And the whole video about how Mariah's problematic. 
I need to upload this part because, like, this is actually pissing me off. <laughs> like, I'm still stuck on the part, like, what corrupts you to do that? Like, groom children, first of all. Like, it's already a big thing. It's already skirting on the illegal part over here. But, like, you, I, 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 really, I really can't. There's a lot of bad people on the internet and in the world in general. Like, there's 7 billion people on this earth. Everyone is not good. That's be about at least 2 billion people who are terrible. Like, in my church, there's a lot of people that are considered terrible, like, and bad people, like, sinners and stuff. But, like, a lot of them aren't. Like, co- like gay people are not sinners, I don't know about that one, Chief. I don't know about that one. Chief people are confused. Like, what What the heck are you... What's wrong, what's wrong with you? That's all I'll talk about. Like, I'm just mentioning church real quickly. Because, like, they... They even... I've never heard anyone, anyone in my church mention pedophilia. I'm not kidding. I don't think I've ever heard them mention pedophilia, like, in a sermon. But they'll talk about gay people. That's for sure. I'm mentioning church right now. I'm not trying to get religious. Because I'm not religious at all. But, like, they just sit up in there bad-mouthing gay people and LGBT. And y- y'all mentioned racist, but, like, y- do y'all not talk about t- pedophilia? I get it's depressing and stuff, but, like, I would talk about pedophilia all day, to be honest, and talk about uh, trashing people that are happy with their lives. I mean, I can't get, th- I can't get into this. I'm sorry I mentioned that. But I just wanted to mention that because, like, I just get pissed off in church all the time hearing that. And then I'm just, like, I'm worrying about pedophiles. Why are y'all so focused on this? <laughs> I just want to know about this. I just want to know. Like, what? I'm sorry for, men- I'm really sorry for mentioning that. But, like, I just want, I-, I really need to mention that. I'm really repeating myself. I'm pissed off. I am 50 minutes into this video. But you're probably going to hear at least, like, 10 minutes of it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna post a part about PP girl, and that's it. Okay, peace. I need to go.